Hey YouTube, this is the final part of the plasma table build. It's not the final ever, I'm still planning to take it to a full CNC table, but for the moment it's going to be used as a manual plasma table. I've got plenty of other projects to go along with, I will get back to it eventually, I hope. In the meantime, let's have a look and see how I finished it up. I'm going to put the sacrificial vase in now. It's in there. Yep, that's it. I want that. Now the idea of having them bent a little bit is so that if the cutter, plasma cutter cuts straight across, it's not going to go right along the top of any of them. That's the theory anyway. Oh, some of these are longer than others. Oh, I think I'll try and straighten that up. I guess now would be the time to do it before I put the next piece in. The cockatoos are in fine voice tonight. All on their final feed before they're on their way home. It's not perfect, but by Jesus, it looks pretty good. Drop the rest of these in now. One short by the looks of it. Not really one short, but I could have used one extra right out on the very edge. I guess he's not a critical one. Yeah, I might get one for him. Probably doesn't matter that much actually. There we go, all the sacrificial bars are in place now. He's actually in the usable state. Yeah, that's the table. I can start using that. There's nothing to catch all the dross coming out of the bottom or anything yet. It's at a usable stage. I have a lot of work left to do on it yet before it's what I want, because I want a full CNC table, but it'll be for plasma cutting in the meantime. Well, YouTube, this is an historic moment, because this is the first time I'm using the plasma table that I've got partially together. It's going to have an XY axis on it and be all computer controlled eventually but we haven't got that far yet. I'm not going to bore you with the details because I'm going to make another video to bore you with the details. In the meantime we're just going to cut this piece of sheet diagonally across the centre so that I can use it for the arm for the front end loader that I'm working on. Oh, it would help if I turned it on first. I thought it was all very quiet. Yeah, that's better. And there we have it. A nice neat cut on the first use of the table. Well, thanks for taking the time to watch this video. If you'd like to see more of my videos, you can go to my channel or go to my website. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to click the like button below. Until next time.